guys what is going on and welcome to my channel so for today's video i am going to be doing a review of the lip smacker lip balm and this is how cute they look like so if you are new to my channel hi hello and i really do love liquid lipstick especially matte liquid lipsticks so in turn i do love lip balms as well because that's what helps my lips looking and feeling like a proper lips so in today's video i am going to be tasting it smelling it as well as seeing if it does nourish my lips or not so if you have not already do not forget to subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon right next to it so that you're notified whenever i do upload and now let's jump right into the video so about the brand lip smackers they have been in the market for a very very long time and finally they are in india and i picked these out from hokmakeup.com so as of now they have only launched with the coca cola products but then they do have like crazy crazy flavors such as they have like a collection with crayola and i think they do smell fruity or they have like a fruity flavors and then they also have like eminem flavors and they have like some cute toys as well they even have an oatmeal cookie flavor a cookie an oatmeal cookie <laughs> so i do hope that they do expand in the future with more flavors in india so right now what i picked up are so the cylindrical ones this is the one that i picked out which is the fanta flavor and the sprite flavor and these retail for 199 rupees and finally the last one that i got is obviously the classic cocola flavor which comes in a can like this which is so freaking cute and even the detailing is amazing now this retails for 399 rupees so this is how it came in and obviously i did rip them off and i never knew this but they are manufactured by wet and wild hmm now i almost forgot to mention the cylindrical one they have about 4 grams of product and the cup version have about 7.4 grams of product now having said all of that there was a huge huge disappointment in the products that i received the first one is the coca cola one the classic coke one now i was so over the moon about the packaging how cute it is and everything but then when i opened it up at that time this lip balm like this is how the inside portion of it is now this lip balm part of it was literally stuck inside over here and i had to tap it out and then take it and use my fingers and put it back over here now that is extremely disappointing like i so really wish i was filming at that time because you would have seen my face falling flat on the ground because i was so over the moon about the packaging i was like a freaking kid opening up a christmas present and then i see this shit so yeah that happened now second one is the sprite one now the problem with this one is once you open it uh yeah Do you guys see the empty part of the lip balm? Yeah, so I was like, what the hell? And then I saw this, like there is lip balm stuck in the cap. Like right inside. It doesn't want to come out. So, I don't know, it is so freaking weird. This is how I just opened it and this is how it looked. And also the problem is wait Ah, uh, you guys. I don't know if you can see this. Do you see how wonky this is opening? I don't know. I I I can see that this is pretty nourishing and all, but I think it kind of melted while it was being transported, and this does not want to go in. So, yeah, that's the problem. and thank freaking god that the fanta one was completely fine there was no issue with the lip balm part of it so everything was completely a okay with the fanta so i do not know if this was a problem while manufacturing or while importing or while it was in the warehouse or i don't even know if this was a one off case or not but i will be emailing hokmakeup.com about this and seeing what can be done so just letting you guys know like an fii if in case you are planning on buying it or if you have already bought it and waiting for it to be delivered so to test these babies out the first one i'm going to use is the fanta one 
So I really don't think they have any color to them. Like, yeah, no color. They do smell like Fanta. I personally do not like Fanta as a soft drink, but they smell good. They are sweet. They are sugary sweet. I really don't think I'm going to put them on as a lip balm. I'm just going to eat them up or just lick them up. They are really, really sweet and it tastes nice, really nice. It does taste a little bit like Fanta, yeah. But I can taste the sweetness more. Mm. So nourishing wise, as a first impression, it does nourish. Just avoid the fact that I did lick almost all of it. But even after that, I can feel the lip balm. It is pretty thick and it's nice. And it's not that very sticky kind of a lip balm. It's a nice lip balm. So next, moving on to the Sprite one. Now this one does smell of Sprite. But it's not a very strong smell, but it is there. I feel this one has melted the most. This one is again with no color. Yeah, it has that Sprite kind of a smell. And this again is very sugary and very sweet to taste. But I do like the nourishing part of it, like irrespective of it being sweet and it does have a taste. But I'm telling you, if you guys buy this, I don't think you will actually wear it on for a long time because you will just end up licking it because it is that sweet and it is that sugary, which is a nice thing. And lastly, for my most favorite soft drink of all time, which is the Coca-Cola One. And this is how it comes in, which is so cute, like I said before. And I'll keep saying it again and again, but the detailing of it, it is amazing. So I also like the fact that the packaging is pretty airtight, like, you heard the click? So it does click once you close it so that you know it is secure. And this is how the lip balm comes in, which I told you was an abomination when I found that it fell. So this smells the strongest, like as soon as you open it, you can smell the Coca-Cola flavor. And I love Coca-Cola flavor anything. Like there is this Candyman candy, which is in Coke flavor and banana flavor are my favorites out of all. As well as these gummy bears that you get in Coca-Cola flavor, which also looks like a Coke bottle. So that is again my favorite. So this is heavenly. <laughs> so about the part about the tint, there is none again. And let me put it on my lips. Again, sweet and sugary and tastes great. Overall, I feel that if you're looking for a lip balm kind of a quality with a little bit of a nice taste, then go for the cylindrical one. But then if you want something which you can keep it in your vanity and so that it looks all nice and cute, then probably get the cup sized one as well. But do remember about the disappointment that I had to go through. I hope it doesn't happen to anyone else. So yeah, these were my opinion and thoughts about the Lip Smacker Lip Balm. And this wraps up today's video, you guys. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, subscribe to my channel and click on the bell icon right next to it so that you're notified whenever I do upload. As well as like the video and comment down below if you have any questions or requests. I'll try my best to do that for you. As well as follow me on my socials, which is It's Nishanayar on Instagram and It's Nishanayar on Twitter as well. So until the next time, take care. Bye.